The one thing we have to watch out for is this downward sloping 200 day moving average, right. which I'll highlight right here. But we had a nice solid candle today and we broke these two prior highs that we had on earnings day and, and on a day a little while ago. A third of the float in Canada Goose is short and we had this nice breakout candle today. So for me, that's something that I always kind of keep an eye on because as you know, if the stock's just tanking, then who cares what the short float is because they're winning. But right. when you get these reverse points and you get these high volume breakout days those can sometimes lead to some pretty wild moves if these shorts need to cover so we've got you know the breakout has already happened on the close today but we do have around say 14.50 or 15 dollars we do have that downward sloping 200 day moving average so i'm going to watch for strength on this guy tomorrow but i'm just going to be cognizant that it could hit that 200 day moving average and reverse